How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to more Judgment. Um, right. We are needing to head back to Yagami Detective Agency now. To rest up, apparently. And yes, we are in the final chapter. Need rest. So basically, it's up to Izumita whether or not Ichinose shows at the trial. The question now is, how do we press Ichinose once he's there? Before we get too far. Genda Sensei and Ayabe are both on board with Yagami san representing the defense. The lousiest lawyer ever. Back in the court. <laughs> Looks like it. Now, let's talk about our next steps. First on the agenda, though. <laughs> what do we call Sugiura now? That's your next step? It was, uh, Terasawa, yeah? I'm fine with Sugiura. Why change it up now? Fair enough. Um, speaking of next steps, I'd like to try putting some pressure on Kido again. Maybe we could use the video Sari-san helped us get to force him into testifying for us. Dude, but if we get Kido on our side, he'd be a powerful plan. witness. Anyone else? This doesn't have anything to do with the case, but some shit's going down in the Matsugane family. We can talk about it right after this, Yagami. Roger that. What's up? Just so you know, I'm gonna go talk to Okubo soon. He still thinks Emi-chan's family hates him for what happened. I need him to know that's not true. If that's okay with you. Sure, I'm fine with it. All right, choose the next stop. I'd like to talk to Kido if possible. He'd make a valuable witness in Ayabe's trial. You've right. got some dirt on him, too. Yeah, thanks to Saori san's little adventure. He won't be able to turn us away once we remind him of that. Yagami san, are you. Yeah, let's do it. Sure, let's do it. We'll need to take a taxi to the ADDC, right? Right. Basis one is this way. Get the taxi. Head down to the ADDC. I knew it would all work out. What do you mean? Seeing Kido without an appointment. That video has some serious power. You can thank Sari-san for that. Afternoon. Sorry to barge in. We know you're busy. Take a seat. <sighs> Well, let's get straight to the point. We'd like to call you to the stand as a witness in Ayabe's trial. That's not possible. Would this change your mind? You've made me a very happy man today. But we have some real fun now that the interview's out of the way, hmm? My little minx. <laughs> Do what you will. Wait, really? Ichinose is unstoppable, and my testimony won't change that. You're up against everyone who stands to gain from 89, including patients who it would save, and their families. You can't win. Not how things stand, no. But that's exactly why we need your testimony. 
I have no obligation to help you. If you truly want to release the video, release it. You are aware of the consequences that would have, right? I'll become the laughing stock of the scientific world. My career will be over. But I'd rather that than make an enemy of Ichinose. I'm not ready to die just yet. Hmm. How can we change your mind? You're in the middle of this whole 89 mess. But you never actually killed anyone yourself. You might be able to argue for a lighter sentence. Absolutely not. You can't convince me to sign my own death warrant. Did you talk to Ichinose after Kuroi will rescue you from the arcade? I have nothing to say about that. Now leave me alone. Are you really that scared of him? Of course. Losing my jaw is a much more appealing proposal than losing my life. Nobody's dying if we can help it. We can protect you. Don't you understand? No matter what I say, you can't win this trial. If I open my mouth, I'll have to live the rest of my life in fear. Until the day they finally finish the job. Damn it. We're not getting anywhere. You shouldn't fight a battle you can't win. I would never have gotten where I am today without that bit of advice. So you don't think we can beat him? <laughs> Do you even have a shred of evidence? Oh, well, I suppose you did. But Ichinose-san took it right out of your hands. Can't you see how weak you are compared to him? You don't have a chance in hell of winning this case. Well, you're right. <laughs> For now, I guess. It's easy to tell how the case will go. We just don't have quite enough evidence yet. There's no way we'll take down Ichinose with what we've got at the moment. I appreciate the advice. Not yet, Yagami-san. He's trying to take us for fools. I can make him talk for sure. All we have to do is push the video to- We'd be wasting our time. You can't say that if you don't try. Come on, Yagami-san. I said we're not doing it. Please, just, just give it a shot. If the video doesn't work, then we'll find some other way to- There's no point. No point? That's enough of the tough detective act. You can't run. Hoshino! I never said anything about running away, okay? But... I just... I don't want to lose. I thought I could help you. <laughs> Having a falling out, are we? Shut up! Once I have my proof, I'll be back. <laughs> and when you do, I will gladly cooperate. Not that I'm expecting much. the agency you want to go see Okubo? yeah it's okay you did right let's go see Okubo. you ready to see Ok? yeah it's time to clear the air Let's go. Yagami-san. Can you give Okubo a message for me? Sure. What's up? Once he gets out, I want to go visit Emmy's grave with him. 
That's a pretty big deal. There's a lot we have to take care of before we can even get to that, though. Yeah. Otherwise, Okubo will get executed and never have his name cleared. We'll fix it. Don't worry. I hope you're right. We can't let him die in there. Agreed. I'll give him the message. Okay. Hold on. I don't believe this. You're serious? Yeah. He told us his name was Sugiura at first. Fumiakun. You know, I only met him once before Emmy's death. Both of us were a little shy, though, so we didn't really talk. I can still remember. How he glared at me during the trial. And how I couldn't even look him in the eye. By the way, he told me to tell you something. Huh? It... Emmy's grave. He wants to visit Emmy's grave with you. I see. He really wants to do that? With me? Yeah. I'd like to take him up on that. Ayabe's trial is coming up. We're gonna snare the guy behind 89. A man from the Ministry of Health by the name of Ichinose. Can you do it, though? For real? We'll yeah. try. The prosecutor's on my side, too. Ichinose won't stand a chance. I'll tell them you're innocent, too. I gave up on that a long time ago. I thought no one would hear me. No matter how loud I scream. I thought I'd die branded a murderer. But if Fumiyakun understands... Maybe there's still a chance. If the guy who hated me most forgives me, maybe everyone else will too. I'll get you out of here. I promise. Okay. Choose the next stop. Back we go. Nope. You said something's going down with the Matsugane family? Yep, it's all pretty much gone to shit. After the Patriarch died, everyone just kind of went their separate ways. Especially the younger guys. Is anyone trying to hold the family together? Guy named Kengo, yeah. You beat the stuffing out of him once or twice, remember? He was one of Captain Hamura's golden boys. I don't remember There's kind of something up with him, though. Don't what? remember him at all. You'll see when we get there. Want to tag along? Okay. Well. Sure.
Sorry for asking you to do this, Yagami. The family's a real mess right now. Sure you don't want to bring Kaito-san along? He got expelled, remember? They wouldn't even let him through the door. Right. Anyway, let's go. Doubt I can stop them all on my own. Stop them? What do you mean? Just come on. Um, probably get taxi. If we can. Here we go. Oh, we need to go around. We can't go around. We'll go around this way then. Hmm. Bench is shortcut. I'm tempted to use like one of the um, one shot things in here because I kind of want to see where this wraps up now. So heads up, we're going to use the thing, the insta kill thing in this. Mostly because I'll explain at the oh, the ending Yo, of this game. I'll go. explain the reason why we started using the insta kill Yagi. stuff. Finally went and brought me Yagami san, huh? Huh? Easy. It's okay. Need something from me? Our patriarch is dead. And I hear you've got the scoop on who did it. You know who the mole is. And I want you to tell us. So you want revenge? We don't just want it. We need to get it. All part of being a Yakuza. You're gonna massacre the son of a bitch! You can't handle it. The fuck you say to me? I've told them that already, but they won't listen. So what do you want me to do? I mean, you're a lawyer, yeah? Isn't persuasion your job? You can't worm your way out of this. Tell us who the mole is! Or do you need a little encouragement? Kengo! Rebuilding this family one way or another. Now stand the fuck down, Ariki. Okay. <laughs> Shit, I didn't. You want to know that bad? I'll tell you. Huh? But <laughs> who is he? <sighs> Kuroiwa, from the Tokyo PD, organized crime. 
bastard's a cop. <sighs> Doesn't end with him, though. Karoi was just a tool for the people really behind all this. They're not afraid of some small-time Yakuza thugs. <laughs> oh, shut up. That's why I'm gonna beat them myself. In court. <laughs> you... You seriously think... You can do that? <laughs> Matsukane-san was like a father to me for the last 20 years. I knew him longer than you guys. I want revenge as bad as you. Maybe more. Can you let me handle this one? <laughs> I owe you one, Yagami. Don't mention it. Later. Killing Kuroiwa wouldn't accomplish shit. He's just the tip of this whole fucked up iceberg. Let Yagami do this. You might even want to consider helping him. Yo. Sorry, Higashi pulled you into that. No worries. Are you spying on me? Not too hard when you've got a drone. <laughs> I guess not, no. Anyways, with Matsugane-san gone, the family's been drifting in the wind like a kite without a string. Looks like you brought him back down to Earth, though. Thanks, man. Uh, you hit your head or something? Yeah, yeah, make your jokes. Just don't say I never said it. Right. Okay. Now we need to head back to the office. Pink Street. There's a taxi up here. Pretty sure like an hour worth of cutscenes at the end. That'd be interesting. Oh. This again. Nah, you're right. Can explode. Welcome back, Yagami-san. Hey, man. How's the prep going for Ayabe's trial? Not bad. I've gone everywhere I wanted to go, at least. So, you ready to do this, then? There's no going back after this. Well, when you put it like that... Things get pretty tense from around, so if there's anything you want to do now is the time. What we could say you engage the case. It's almost the end of the story, so settle in for the climatic finale. It could take a while, so if you need sleep, continue at your own discretion. You can save along the way, but once you start, you can so you go back. To get this... uh, right, let's make a right. separate save then. Alright. This has got a little way to go. So what we'll do, guys, we'll end the episode here. Uh, and then in the next episode, we'll probably make it quite a long one. Push the end of the game, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure you go hit the like button, subscribe, most importantly, get yourselves a beautiful day, and bye-bye.